It started. We're going to the Nexus. Also, I planned this really well because the quest, quest line is directly behind my face. So instead of... Captain wants to see a full duty roster. Yeah, <laughs> duty. Just updated the charts. Hang on, I'm gonna try to climb this. Let your teams know the docking procedures are now in effect. We've got 20,000 tolerance. Damn it, I can't climb shit. Somewhere to put them when the alarm clock goes off. Open door. Everybody on the safe? Alright, let's rock and roll. It'll be nice to see some friendly faces this time. The Nexus runs a support crew, just enough to finish building Let's the look station out the window. and provide safe harbor for the Arks. Means we can start waking our people up. They built or a does it? Gotta have champagne for the welcome party. You're expecting one? After what we've been through, I could use a bus. We all could. This game is pretty cool so far, though. They, I am digging it. Real food and a shower are just ahead. See, they're all like, hey, let's, let's can't wait for this happy stuff. When really, you know, angry alien stuff is going to happen. Here we are. Uh, I don't see any champagne. Where is everybody? You know what? I saw that movie Passengers. This is exactly what it looks like. Well, this can't be right. It's like everything's on standby. Hmm. They're doing the awfully good job. Welcome to the Nexus, gateway to Andromeda. Just tell me what's going on, bitch. A virtual intelligence designed to assist you with immigration. Uh, can you tell us where the welcome party is hiding? I'm sorry. My code is limited to information and simple interaction simulation. Well, just tell me what's happening. From the following pre-programmed responses. All right. Current year. What year is it? The current year is 2819. After spending over 600 years in stasis, it's normal to feel disoriented or confused upon arrival. Our helpful medical staff can assist with any physical or psychological after effects you may be experiencing. Well, she's got the date right, at least. So where is everyone? All right, uh, the Nexus. Bitch, where are the you? Nexus? The Nexus serves as the central hub for the Andromeda Initiative's colonization effort. It is the first destination for all colonists upon their arrival in the new galaxy. Please enjoy the many venues the Nexus has to offer. As the station expands, it will one day serve as the seat of government for... This isn't Ray anything Hall. I want to know. Providing a safe, stable, and prosperous environment is our primary goal. Not from the looks of it. All right, I'm gonna log off. That's all. Because you suck. It has been my pleasure. Please see one of our helpful immigration staff for further assistance. Thanks. And welcome to your new home in Andromeda, where the brightest star is you. Oh. Current wait time for immigration processing is unknown error. Right. That was helpful. That, this is literally right out of that movie, Passenger. Seriously. Plants are still alive. It's like they. All right, there's nothing behind this box. Hello. There's a guy. Maybe he's got champagne. Hey, fella. Hi there. Wonder where the nachos are. And wondering you. Did you say an arc? Wait. Pretty sure we parked in the right place. Your VI over there could use an update. Of course, I'm sorry. It's just we thought you were all dead. What? Or captured or lost. But you're here. You have no idea how much this means. I no, don't I don't. I have no idea what's happening. Tyrion Kandros. I lead our militia on the Nexus. You have a weird voice, Tyrion. I'm Ryder. 
This is Cora Harper and Liam Costa, part of the Pathfinder team. I'm sorry for the confusion. Our sensors told us an arc had arrived, but Helios is notorious for scrambling equipment. We thought you were just another malfunction. Yeah. Well, I've got a shipload of people that says we're here. Of course, it's just... You're the first arc we've seen. After a year of waiting and no sign of the others, we shuttered this area and stopped looking. You've been stranded for a whole year? Longer. I'll fill you in on the way to Op Center. A lot of weird stuff happening here. Everything that could go wrong with our plan has. Where'd you go? We arrived 14 months ago. Right away, we hit a band of dark energy that knocked us off course. We're familiar with it. Then you'll know why we call it the Scourge. We lost whole sections of the station. A lot of people died. No power, no food. The chaos went on for months. It finally led to armed rebellion. When order was restored, the insurgents were banished. Exiles, we called them. Are things back to normal? Not even close. But you're here now, so maybe the worst is over. No word from the other Pathfinders? No word I'm looking out the window. Period. Any threats from the locals? So far, we've stayed hidden. We're here. Hey, let's quick. Well, guys, go ahead. I'll check out the security situation. You should know our command. It's, it's his first time ever here, and he knows what he's doing. Some of us are filling in for leaders who died. Is it true? They said drop everything and report for duty. And no one <laughs> Duty. Was expecting an arc to finally show up. Docking procedures are green across the board. Stand by to merge Hyperion power into the grid. The crew of the Hyperion. Good luck. I'm Jaren Tan, director of the initiative. You have no idea how much your arrival means. Uh... We've heard about what happened, and we're ready to help. We could use any supplies you have. Food, water, we're My short on everything. His. This is Foster Addison. She oversees colonial affairs. Where's the Pathfinder? You're looking at him. You're not Alec Ryder. My father's dead. He made me his successor. What's up now? Alec is dead. Please understand, the entire initiative is at risk. None of the Golden Worlds panned out. They're a bust, and there's been no word from the other arcs. What happened to them? Unknown. Our supplies are nearly depleted. Rationing bought us some time, but even that's running out. We need to find more resources, <laughs> but that takes people. And we can't wake them up. Until they have somewhere to live. A golden world. Now more than ever, we need a Pathfinder. It now well, falls to you. Again, right? I just, just said that I am the Pathfinder. The task? You don't have a choice. I could be a dick. Let's hope so. No, you know what? We'll be confident. And a heart, a heart inside the head. I may not have been the first choice. But I'm ready for this. Youthful enthusiasm will only get you so far in Andromeda. You shut up. That's no way to treat a guest. What? I'm Nak Morkesh, superintendent of this station. Hope they haven't scared you off already. Guarantee it's he does personal, whatever sex he is. He does the same, same type of alien sex to as himself. We could use a fresh perspective. You've heard my concerns. I'll leave you to it. Some alien dude on dude stuff. We're all feeling the pressure. Let's have a private word in my office, Ryder. We'll discuss giving you a scout ship. I'm happy to work out the details with your associate. Welcome to the Nexus. We're gonna sleep together? Thank you for standing up for me there. Hmm. Hopes in short supply here. What little we can find should have a chance. Ma'am, well, I think it's a girl. Is now online. Let me show you something. An hour ago, that was all dark. But with the power from your ship, you're keeping the lights on. You have my vote. 
power runs out? You'd best go talk to Director Tan. Make sure that doesn't happen. And don't be shy. Come see me when you have a chance. I'm pretty sure he just came on to me. I'm not, I didn't buy this game to read. I can kind of read behind my head. Speak with the director, Tan, and Pathfinder headquarters. Every time they say docking area, I can't help but laugh. This is the planet where we landed. Habitat 7. It wasn't even close to livable. That's been true of every world we found. Ryder, we were discussing your next expedition. You said all... all jerky. Trust me now. Well, bo both are kind of jerk things, so you know what, I might as well... I will say the jerkier thing. I thought it didn't measure up as Pathfinder. Director Addison keeps her own counsel. I keep mine. And when you disagree? I oversee the entire initiative, and I have decided to give you a chance to prove yourself. I poked you right end, in the eye of her. The dealt is a serious blow. Whatever it is, our scientists theorize it's not natural. An artificial energy cloud? It wasn't here when we left the Milky Way. Yet it rendered all the golden worlds unlivable. Then there's the aliens you ran into, the Ket. They're obsessed the with alien Ket. structures we found scattered around the cluster. They'll do anything to prevent others from accessing them. He's French. Since murder isn't exclusive to the Milky Way. That's and why you look weird. To settle a world in spite of all that. This one here, Eos. Oh. You need to increase the viability of the planet so we can establish an outpost. Then we can bring more colonists out of stasis. The more colonists the we have, the more resources we can gather to support the Nexus. Everything depends on it. There are six worlds we hope to settle. Okay, but you said every planet you found is unlivable. So, how do I... A good Pathfinder would relish the challenge of solving it. Right. I oh, think man. I should go... Seriously, I would punch... And if I fail, I guess it's no sweat off your back, right? You'll just look for another Pathfinder? Placing bets on people is part of my job. Some of them pay off. Others... Yeah, I want to be a jerk to you. I don't like you. The way I see it, you need me. If I pull this off, maybe you'll look like the leader you pretend to be. Oh, but snap! You have to succeed at being the Pathfinder you pretend to be. Snap! Where's my ship? They're prepping it now in the docking bay. The core <laughs> for ears will be in the moment. We should discuss the missing arcs. I was wondering about that. Ah. Something wrong? Ryder, King me and Sam live on the Hyperion. Your implant needs attention, and we need to discuss a confidential matter. No, I'm fine. I move my head again. Hold. Start to track. Speaker Director Tan, the Pathfinder, I already did that. I really should have planned this whole face in the middle of the words thing better. Safe. Speak with Sam on Hyperion. Hyperion. My arms got the brunt of it. Stuff exploding like this happen often? Back right after the mutiny, we had a lot of this happening. But not lately. I wasn't there during the mutiny. Lucky. I thought we were done with this, honestly. That maybe I was just being paranoid. Uh, 
You know what they say. It's not paranoia. If someone is out to get to you, yeah. Third time this week. It's getting worse. First one was small stuff. This one could have hurt bad if I'd been closer. That's not good. Sorry, understatement. You know, things can't yeah. be all that bad. This guy's shaped up. And now I have more repairs. Is up to par, so the, I mean, he's got to have time to do that. Did you talk to security about this? How can I? For all I know, someone in security is the one doing this. I've scanned all the potential sabotage areas I can yeah, think of. Yeah, you're talking to me, who you don't even know. I don't know who to trust anymore. Sounds like a lot went down before the Hyperion docked. Yeah, I guess. Wait, that's it. You can't possibly be involved in this. You weren't even here during the mutiny. Would you, if, if you have time? Maybe you could help me if they start hitting critical systems. Sure thing. What can I do? If you could scan these other panels while I fix this one, that would really help. I've sent the locations to your Omni tool. Just send me the data when you're done. Why did you do that? We were just talking the whole time. Hello, I'm Gian Garson, founder of the initiative. It's through your hard work that the vision of the Nexus has come to life. You and all your colleagues bind our proud new colonies together. Look around at your achievements. And if you have any questions, my door is always open. Founder Garson's office is located at workspace not allocated. Please select the topic. I don't, I don't care about any of this stuff. Do I have to do that? Oh, bitch, if I gotta listen to that again, I'm... Welcome back, Pathfinder. Please select a topic. You are a free rider. Salary code 19B. Active Pathfinder. Your supervisor is Director Tan. Based on current staffing needs, you will be eligible for paid vacation time in 587 days. Seriously? Why not plan on which beautiful colony you'll vacation on while you wait? Integration from the Hyperion is ongoing. Personnel are still restricted to operations. Viable planets, capable of supporting life, are key to our survival in Andromeda. The viability of a world is affected by several factors, including temperature, resources, threat levels, political stability, and so on. We have a wolf right in front of the screen while I'm looking at it. Range. Resource levels are considered at risk. Ugh. The selection process saw the Andromeda Initiative evaluate thousands of potential habitable planets within the galaxy. After discovering an unusually high ratio of potential candidates for Golden Worlds, the Helios Cluster was selected as our destination. Even at a distance, studying the light from stars can reveal much about their planet's composition and atmosphere. Seven worlds, nicknamed Habitats, have the life-supporting environments and resources we need to start our new lives in Andromeda. For initiative strategy and Pathfinder coordination, please see Director Jaron Tan. For colonial affairs or outpost status, please see Director Foster Addison. For station maintenance, please contact Superintendent Nack Morkesh. For militia operations or Apex deployment, please see Tiran Kandros. Alright, so it's all of the stuff. But it says I still gotta... Girl? Hey there. You okay? Those guys really grilled you. And Addison. First Pathfinder they've seen in over a year. All she can do is question your competence? Which one was Addison again? All politicians look the same to me. 
same here. Next time, we'll ask for a seating chart. I worked out logistics with Director Tan. They're giving us a ship and crew. He said their best is taken care of. I still need to head back to the Ark and check in with Sam. Sounds good. While you're there, maybe see how your sister's doing. You told me how to look. Hello, Ryder. Welcome back to Sandoad. What up, Sam? I just my connection to your implant. The headache you experienced before shouldn't reoccur. Yeah, what was that about? You said we need to discuss something confidential. You should know certain facts before you leave on your expedition. It seems best we speak alone. I don't understand the need for secrecy. Your father felt it was for the best. What was he trying to hide? My true capabilities. Alec overrode the implant safety protocols. It allows me unrestricted access to the Pathfinder's physiology. And that's me now. And only you. I can act as a force multiplier, dramatically enhancing your motor and neural skills when required. Alec called them profiles. They provide unique tactical augmentation during combat. Your father preferred to keep this fact to himself. I can understand. People might get the wrong idea. Super soldiers. A computer having control over a human. Providing an enhancement to the human. It is a symbiotic relationship that benefits both. What do you get out of it? Though I'm artificial in design, I am fully sentient. Far beyond what even the initiative understands. I don't follow. You're an AI. So what's different? I am a new form of AR, drawing directly from the human experience. Your implant is my window into the world. <laughs> wow, is it? But the human's still in charge, right? Of course. I was never intended to supplant the Pathfinder, only to support and enhance your abilities. Good to hear. So what's the plan? I find myself in an unusual position. Though I have access to your father's experiences, there is a gap in my understanding. How so? He placed a block on portions of my memory array. Why? Perhaps so when you asked me what his plan was, I wouldn't know. And Dad strikes again. But not without recourse. The further you explore as a Pathfinder, the more blocks will be removed. Perhaps you should begin in your father's quarters. In the meantime, unless you have more questions, your new ship awaits. Thanks. What the hell is, what is this? Investing combat tech with biotic skills to unlock more powerful profiles in a variety of styles. It's cool because you can actually upgrade your your people here. Oh look, I have points for them.
I like that. All right. The coffee machine mom got for dad. He was so busy designing you, maybe the caffeine. I did not realize I owed my existence to a being. And now you know what humility feels like. What's on here, Sam? Your father's personal logs. Several of them are encrypted. That log is not currently accessible. Unlocking my memory array may enable it. That log is not currently accessible. I hate it. I hate you so much, Sam. May enable it. Just for giggles. That log is not currently accessible. Unlocking my memory array may enable it. Uh. Father's first sidearm, a memento of his early alliance service. I bet that saw plenty of action. Alex's first kill occurred in combat during the first contact war. Back when Turians were the enemy. Crazy times. I'm not even sure what I just picked up there. All right. Well, this was a waste of time. I'm ready to kill stuff again. Tell me to go back. I just there's someone in the wrong place. Ready to see what Tan gave us? I hear it's something special. Pathfinder en route. How's the ship? And final checks looking great. We won't be long. The way things are going, we'll be on our own out there. In other words, we're making this up as we go. <laughs> we used to call that tactical improvisation. But at least we'll be doing it in style. They call her the Tempest. Look. Let's go and kill aliens. Sorry, dear. Let's pick it up a bit, people. We're 14 months late. So you're the one who's making everything happen. Vetra. Vetra Nix. Initiative Wrangler, Provisioner, Gunner, and everything in between. Cool. Are we ready? 
The sooner we get out of here, the better. You're coming with us? Yes. Otherwise, there's no way they're letting this ship off the station. I don't care. Yeah. I just want to go kill. Let's go see the rest of Helios. Hold it, hold it. You're not going anywhere. Damn it. Whatever happened, it wasn't me. I just got here. Director Addison wants to see a complete report of the Tempest supplies, munitions, and crew. Director Tan overruled Addison. The ship's loaded out with equipment for outpost discovery, squarely under Director Addison's purview. Senior around Ben, right? I think she's gonna snap us now. Came here with the family, didn't you? Snap it! Sun still in cryo? I could pull some strings, get him to the front of the line. Really? Yeah, really. They told me he wasn't essential, but I miss him. I know. I got family too, Ben. It's done. Addison's gonna kill me. Phew. Thank goodness. For a sec, I thought I was going to have to deal with Addison again. <laughs> and no one wants that. All things considered, it was an easy ask. And right now, you need people tearing down obstacles, not putting up more. Finally, someone who cares about doing stuff and not just talking about it. I got a truth. And this is the black screen, which is the, the main part of the game. You'll see everything right here. This is, this is it. This is the highlight, the climax, where it's at. Everything state-of-the-art. Labs, sensors, exploration gear, lesser crew, of course. The best in their field. Ah, glad to see you looking well. The engine core is based on the Ark's Odyssey drive. It runs a hell of a lot quieter. That's Gil Brody. Engineer, mechanic, all-around wrench jockey. We call this the research room. There's space for upgrading equipment, gathering intel. Router engaged. Securing connection to Tempest. Welcome aboard, Sam. And Ryder, of course. All run by Suvi Anwar, our science officer. Your quarters are below. Plenty of space up here to get everyone together. It's all yours. She's light, stealthy, and the fastest ship in her class. Oh, I just want to kill aliens. It's no offense really to the aliens standing next to me. I haven't even shown you the best part. Not nearly in boobies. Head over to the bridge. Our pilot should have everything good to go. Go to the bridge. Better I'm not sure if you can see that behind go. my head, but I can. I can at least read it. And that's my next thing. Going to the bridge. Go to the bridge. The meeting room. You can make vid calls from the central table or just get the crew together. Some serious kill over here. Picard the bridge. Departure trajectory locked, Nexus Control. Ah, time for introductions. Oh, you I already met you. Gallo Jack, a pleasure to be oh, here. Oh, you know what? And to meet you, you guys all look course. like. I'll be piloting the Tempest. Alien racism. Quite the ship, but it'll take a Pathfinder's guidance to see us through Helios.
I'm new to this. Being a Pathfinder running a ship? You'll be fine. As for the ship, I can help. I knew the Tempest when she was a blueprint. I was test pilot for the Tempest's early prototypes. I admit, I'm itching to see how she performs out here. So how do I... The console syncs with your implant. Just swipe, touch a destination here, and the nav system calculates everything. Very efficient. How do I get to where we kill aliens? For a Pathfinder. Everything's secure, if you're ready. Is anyone ready for something this big? I guess we have to be. All right. Excuse me. Excuse me. Command access is transferring successfully. Eh, uh, science and monitoring stations look fine. Lexi's reporting in. Helm is green. Gill reports the drive core is online. This is it, Ryder. The Tempest is yours. Unless you... Uh, let's do that one. We were all expecting a golden world. Now there's just a long road ahead. But hold on to that dream. It might see us through. Nexus Control, this is the Tempest. Ident 2527, prepping to depart. Our Pathfinder is saying weird shit. That's where we are. Do I click here? Is that going to the same place? We'll go Mahan. Not sure what's what am I doing with this? I literally have no idea what I'm doing. I don't want to read about this planet. I want to go. Can I? I want to drive here. I don't want to scan a planet.
Oh, wait. Boy, pro. Detecting what's left of a ship. Hey. Thank you, Mama. I honestly, I'm, I'm making this up right now. I have absolutely no idea what's going on or how to do it. Do I do? How do I go somewhere to kill aliens? It's the shit that I was already looking at. I'm getting pissed off. All right, it's smoking. I get it. Now, what do I do? And why am I looking at a spaceship? Can I just get out of this altogether? Why am, why am I even doing this? This is crazy. I was flying from planet to planet to look at uh, a piece of... Uh, Alright. Oh look, my percentage bar is going up, so I gotta be doing the right thing. I'm just gonna keep scanning these planets. But I have no idea why. I don't know what you just said.
anomaly on sensors. What is sensors? Why am I, what am I doing? All I want to do is just go around shooting aliens. Anomaly detected. Where? I really, really hope Go. this is taking me to a place Go. where I can shoot aliens. System Hippias. Andromeda Initiative Habitat 1. Designated Eos. It was supposed to be an easy first step. Until no one else showed and we got clobbered. Twice. Why has Sam altered frequency detection? What are we hearing, Sam? There is a signal pathfinder. I recommend an immediate examination of EOS. If I'm sitting here examining planets again, I'm gonna be pissed. Oh, I'm gonna scream. What is this game? A mirror of the signal on Habitat 7. Possible atmospheric manipulation. Is that possible? We'll find out. If it is like Habitat 7, no doubt we'll run into the cat. Yes. Yes. As, as that gets me off this stupid ship. Load out screen allows you to choose your equipment and squad mates before embarking on a mission. I guess. I don't know what I'm doing. I just want to shoot aliens. Suiting up. Ready, Freddy. Hope we're all that ready. Callow. All right. Integrating search area from Sam. How he pulled that mystery signal through the storms, I have no idea. Multi-sensory neutral creation. Amazing. Factory fresh across the board. Spinning up the compensators. You're already tuning the displays. We'll get a better read on this pass than the Nexus has had in months. What? I said a lot of people had their hopes pinned on us. They gave up on Eos. I can't blame them. Expected a golden world, instead they saw their friends die. Never know how that'll affect. Sorry. You okay? I don't want to talk about this. I've got the training, people, the tools. We can do this. Pathfinder, the Tempest checks out. We're good. Take us down. You have no idea how long I've wanted. I'm gonna end up sleeping with her. Those are facts.
There. Set us down at this nav point. It's a longer video than I had originally anticipated. So we'll go for a little bit. I'll kill a bunch of aliens. And we'll end it from here on. I'll do very shorter, much shorter videos, very shorter. For those of you who like uh, shitty words. Alright. How Kill. Start. Reports state this planet suffers deadly storms that are contaminated by radiation from the scourge. EO's deployment was incomplete due to environmental hazards and... Doors getting emergency power, but it's code locked. Site 1 issued individual security codes. Each outpost self-organizes and sets its own protocol. Just say we can't open it without codes. We can't open it without codes. They must have known these wouldn't last in these conditions. If they didn't have a pathfinder. They do now. We'll make EOS a home. Oh, stop. Got a code lock key. That should help get us in. Stupid chair. We suffered our first death today. Storm came out of nowhere. Lost his to cover our crops. Lost his footing. Got swept away. His wife is still in cryo. Maybe by the time they wake her up, I'll know what to say. All right. Got those codes. Whoa, what was that? So that's my new thing? I can do that? Ah, oh, what? Those are a hell of some upgrades. Are they shooting at something? I can't read it because my handsome face is in the way. I got a partial log, but I can't. Something's blocking the power. A remote lock is active. The interference originates from a nearby power relay tower. Sandstorms, radiation. Let's check out this relay tower. Setting is here. EOS might have looked great back in the Milky Way, but up close, it's a hellscape. Farthingale's on my case to stay positive. Put on a brave face for the rest of the team, but I can't shake the feeling that I'm going to die out here. This atmosphere makes it difficult to cultivate life. Radiation? Our suits protect against that, right? Site 1 contains shield masts to dampen the brunt of contamination. But if we went outside Site 1's perimeter? That would not be advised. Structure up ahead. Sam? It fits the profile of a power relay station pathfinder. Right. We get it running, maybe buildings get power. And we get a line on that signal. It's inoperable, Pathfinder. Too long in this environment without power. We didn't expect this kind of environment. Who could? Huh. Guess that 
ship wasn't kept. Boop, 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 boop. They don't knock. There are people here? We thought everyone left was gone. Of course you did. Now shove off. Find your own salvage. This spot's taken. I'm not a salvager. I'm a pathfinder. We've come to fix all this. Call me Clancy. Pathfinder, huh? Like that changes much. The Nexus just can't let Eos go, can it? However much it fails down here. I'm tracking a signal that will help Eos. I only need power for the antenna. Look, I cut the power for a reason. The Ket are patrolling today. You turn the power relay back on, they'll know there's a juicy target alive down here. Help me with the power relay, and I'll take care of the cat. You're crazy. Well, maybe it's a good crazy. Okay, I'll enable the generators out there. Thank you. you. The tiger. It's on you. I want to kill aliens. Expect trouble when we start the generators. There's an error in the startup sequence. Manual input required. Damn it. Please scan one of the pylons to determine a hackable input location. Scannable interface on the power pipe. Ah, right. This analysis provides us with important research data, Pathfinder. If you generator interface possible, location marked. Oh, I always forget about that thing. Generator is active. Part of the outpost team here? No, Pathfinder. According to Nexus records, he's stationed in the hangar bay. So he's what? Play hooky? Or he's a part time. Really, Ryder? I heard grunting in the background. We've got company. Where? All I want to do is kill aliens.
took down all those cat. Sure, use the power the relay. Hell, take whatever you like. Word of advice, though. If that signal of yours is out past the perimeter, you'll need a ride. A ride? Shuttles aren't fun in these winds. You need wheels. I think they kept a little something in storage. Didn't get around to salvaging it yet? I tried. It ain't that simple. Might be easier for a Pathfinder, though. We're heading to our shuttle. Keep this up. Maybe next time we'll find more than just salvage around here. Go on. We'll take it from here. I guess Crazy Blue has to buy her parts from someone else. Power restored. We should have access to everything in Site 1 now, right, Sam? Correct. Plus, I've located the source of the signal we detected in orbit. It's coming from the large alien structure just beyond Site 1. The structure appears almost identical to the one your father used to adjust the atmosphere on the previous planet. It's worth investigation. That almost feels like a lead. Damn right it's worth investigating. Hear, <laughs> hear. A warning. Radiation levels beyond the perimeter of Site 1 are well above acceptable limits. You cannot proceed without additional protection. All the more reason to see if that alien structure can make a difference to this planet. Come on, we better find that vehicle Clancy mentioned. Three. Now the power is restored, we can viability investigate the points. Viability. viability increased. Ah, the old army gel canister. Ah, stuff. Well, what do you know? The outpost research center is still intact. Updating the Tempest on this critical recovery. Research was always key to the initiative. We'll need it here too. This tech is how we survive in Andromeda. Ingenuity on the ground. Someone else agrees. This research center was used recently to monitor the alien signal. This gives us the tools to find the source, and maybe whoever else is looking. Element zero. Detected via orbital scan.
Not really sure where the Hey, stuff. Cool. Terran rivets and coolant cells. Again, I have no idea what I'm picking up here. I think I should still be in here then. You know what? Scan thing. Oh, look. The research station is back online. I've provided a list of weapons we can build by gathering the required components. Select development to craft new items and upgrades. Uh, development. Containers to find a vehicle. This one kind of looks like it would. Special requisition all terrain scout rover. A Nomad, six-wheel drive, jump jets, just what you need. I might be drooling a little bit. This must be what Clancy meant. The crate requires an access code from a forward station. Forward stations act as emergency resupply checkpoints. Several are currently in orbit. I can call one down. Let's find a good spot. All right, we'll call this down, and then we'll call this video a day. Activating automated forward station deployment. Station supplies are intact. Downloading Nomad Crate access code. All right. Stop it right now. Yes. Uh, yeah. Yes, I will answer the vehicle. Oh, Should handle pretty smooth. Check both forward and reverse, would you? Yeah, this thing is diesel.
Look, before I sign off, I'm gonna try to get on top of the ship. But as I'm doing this, this was just a lot of gameplay, farting around, and also uh, seeing what the game's all about. No, 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 come on! Ah! But if you liked it, if it was fun, if it helped, made you decide whether or not you're going to buy this game, uh, I'm glad. So give it a like, give me a subscribe, and I will definitely be putting out better videos than this. Yes. Oh, oh, easy. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, press that subscribe button. Uh... Alright, no, but seriously, press the subscribe button, press that like button, and thank you for viewing.